While the spider trees of Pakistan may have been very temporary and very strange, it's not hard to see how they were in their own strange way also quite beautiful. You see, in the latter half of 2010, massive floods swept the country, managing to not only uproot the lives of about 20 million people, but also uproot the lives of the local arachnid populations. With more than a fifth of the country submerged, millions of spiders climbed into the trees to escape the rising floodwaters, and due to the long length of time they were forced to stay there, they began to spin massive webs around local trees. These webs completely cocooned the trees in spider silk, and while they led to the creation of strange, wispy-looking trees, they also had an unexpected positive side effect. This is because the large number of spiders effectively decimated the local mosquito populations, causing rates of mosquito-borne illnesses such as malaria to be very low, despite the large amounts of sitting water. Since this sitting water could have led to the deaths of thousands in the aftermath of the disaster, I think you'd agree that the spider 